evening we are starting with the part drawing of a screw jack body you can see the screw jack body over here okay and uh, first we have to make it ordered and we have to on the base reference planes the total height of the screw jack is 125 the drawing which are which you are seeing is in the front view <coughs> the front view is mostly preferred because most of the dimensions are visible in the front plane okay so we select sketch and select the front plane okay so line option is automatically selected we'll start from this point or this point any point you can start from from here I will be starting so the total height of this screw jack is 185 press ok then fit to the screen and from here the total only the shaded part we are drawing since we are drawing only the shaded part the total circular length is circular diameter is 70 so since we are taking the half so I will consider 35 half of 70 that is 35 press ok and down you can see it is 40 mm so here it is 40 mm 40 mm and ok so we'll come at the bottom bottom the total length is 250 so we are giving 250 divided by 2 that is 125 sorry it's 140 140 select the line option so half of 140 that is 70 mm 70 and here it is 20 mm okay and you can see a dimension here 66 a little gap is there that is of 3 mm why 70 minus 66 4 sorry it's 2 mm 70 minus 66 that is 4 since we are taking only the half so half of 4 is 2 mm so from here it is 2 mm 2 mm okay and here it is 20 mm you can see a distance of 100 mm over here up to this surface it's 100 mm this one so 140 minus 100 total length is 140 this is 100 so 140 minus 100 is 40 so since we are taking half so half of 40 is 20 mm so we draw a line of 20 mm this side and just join this end of the 2 mm line just join here fit to the screen ok later go to offset option offset option select this line right click outside the thickness is given as 10 mm the thickness is 10 mm ok 10 mm inside right click a line is created if you want to extend you can use the option extend to next we want to extend this line ok and I will trim this this and the thickness is 10 mm the thickness is 10 mm or 70 minus 50 that is 20 so 20 half is 10 10 mm I will draw and I will just extend this line up to here where it intersects and you can trim this undesired lines okay fit to the screen this completes our basic sketch 
and uh, one more glue is remaining at the bottom glue of 3 mm thickness okay it is 3 mm hollow from here i will be starting it is 3 mm and the length from the center is 100 total is 100 so half is 50 half is 50 mm and just bring this line down you can zoom it and if you want to move an object just go to pan you can move it right click to come out of the window then trim trim this also this and since the chamfer is not given chamfer angle is not given you can take it as one you can see at the right bottom of your page that is 1 into 45 it is not given if it is not given you have to take 1 into 45 so go to you can uh, either do here or you can do directly uh, using the round option I have taken the fillet option select this and this and Q radius 1 mm 1 mm or 2 mm sorry it's 2 mm go to chamfer uh, fillet select this this and give a radius of 2 mm fit to the screen since it is not given so you can either take 1 mm or 2 mm and here also it is not given so take here 1 mm then take here 1 mm go to fillet select this one and this line and give a radius of 1 mm press fit to the screen and next option we are completed with the sketch now go to close sketch close sketch ok and fit to the screen go to revolved protrusion first it is asking us to select the sketch chain this is the sketch chain next you have to click right click on the screen and later you have to select the axis of symmetry this has the axis of symmetry rotated by 360 degree ok our sketch is created and one more radius you can find that is R8 we can use the round command round command select this and give a radius of 8 select give a radius of 8 this completes our screw jack body so place save it and you have to save in isometric mode and just check it this is our screw jack body